It's about 10:28 at night, <laughs> and I just don't like putting out. I just don't like putting out any content on weekends. I'm supposed to be sleeping, you know. <laughs> Hello, viewers. Another beautiful day or night. Yeah. Hope your five senses work. Health and strength is good. We're excellent. What? All right. Okay, okay, you AMD AMD nerds, geeks, and freaks. All right, I, I got some for you. Listen to this. Hmm. Ready? It says AMD released new chipset driver for Windows 10 and 11. Yeah. Yeah, you AMD fans are just spoiled. Got eight comments, so I'm gonna go through. It says here, uh, if you own, if if you if you have a computer powered by a modern Ryzen or a Thread Thread Ripper processor. Then there is a new chipset driver for you to download. AMD has released version 6.6.07.22.037 with bug fixes and unknown new program support. Here are the official release notes with highlight and known issues. Release release highlights. New program support added. Bug fixes. And then subtopic, known issues. Some drivers name a non-English OS may appear in English. The uninstalled summary may incorrectly display the uninstalled status as failed. Occasionally, Ryzen PPKG may not install slash upgrade. And then it says, uh, here's a more detailed list of the new drivers in the package, including the AMD Power Management Framework. PF, uh, PMF driver for the new Ryzen AI 300 processor. It says our AMD PSP, PSP driver uh, 532.0.0 bug fix. Uh, PT GPIO driver 3.0.2.0 bug fix. AM, AMD PPM provision file driver 8.0.038. AMD USB 4 CM driver 1.0.0.42 bug fix. It says AMD uh, AMS mailbox driver 4.0.0833 bug fix. And AMD SSFH 1.1 driver 1.1.0.21 bug fix. And AMD driver, and then it says in parentheses AMD PCI AMD SM bus. AMD Heathrow uh, and uh, AMD uh, R RCEC and that's new program support and that's 2.0.0.20 and for AMD PMF AI Ryzen series driver 24.6.18.0 new driver added it says AMD chipset uh, software driver 6.7.22.0.37 is available, available for the following and let's see, A series, AMD Ryzen, AMD uh, A A320, and uh, A520, and then for the B series is B uh, AMD B350, B450, B550, B650, and B650E, and then for the X series is uh, X370, X470, X570, X670. And X670E, and then for the TRX WRX is a uh, TRX 40, 50, 80. Now TRX 40, 50, and WRX 80, 90. Yeah, and it says support operating system include only 64-bit Windows 10 and 11. You can download the latest AMD chipset driver from the official website. Detailed release notes and the list of supported processors are available on the same page. In case you miss it, AMD recently released its first driver for upcoming Windows 11 version 24.h2. They include previous uh, chipset driver and a recent Radeon software graphics driver. So there, you AMD AMD fans, you're covered. Yeah. Okay. And that goes and that goes for the Steam Deck too. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, See what else? Got eight comments here. Let's see what they let's see what they yapping about here in the comments section. Okay. Sparrow said this. The link to the driver package are on their website. It's busted. And then Gothic Gothic said this. 
like like you click the link and AMD page return with not found LOL <laughs> and then and then third said this uh, probably not live yet there is no link either on their driver page last update was in June and then and then I I as I said this uh, if you go to the specific MB page the link are live are live there and then he leaves the link <laughs> And then um, uh, Viper said this, uh, like like the like the problem is just an extra underscore in the link on the main page. That's only the difference versus the link on the X X570 page. And then he says software is 6.07.22.037. Software is 6.707 that is .22.037. Nexus said this, I was able to download the driver via there. Just pick the chipset, then you then your motherboard chipset and download the link. I presented it for Windows 10 and 11. And then uh, Gore, Gore, is it Gore said this, I have I have sent I have sent a tweet to AMD. Hopefully they will fix this soon. Uh, regards uh, and he said uh, uh, Gorski. <laughs> anyway. I ain't gonna read out his first name though. And then uh, Morpheus said this: uh, with bug fixes and unknown new program support. Don't you love that? Hey, we put in some new uh, program support for drivers. What's that? Really don't know, but it's there if you need it. <laughs> anyway, well, don't worry. AMD AMD got you guys covered. I would say give it give it give. I would say by Monday they, they should have this 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 thing sorted out. And then, and then go on from there. But other than that, man, um, AMD is staying busy and staying competitive in this tech world, you know. Staying on their toes, you know. Of course, they got NVIDIA to deal with, Intel to deal with, so, yeah. They got to gotta stay, AMD has to stay on their A game, you know, so. They have a new driver update for Windows 10 and 11, so. Um, any more news break on this? I'll let you know. Yep. Of course, they got the they got the uh, what's that the RDNA four, five, six, and of course seven that they're working on. So, and I think they won't show. Uh, I think they won't show like uh, RDNA seven t till the next I think CES so next year. So, AMD is busy. Yeah. Keeping you AMD fans happy, <laughs> yeah. And Linux operating Linux operating system developers, they're busy. So is Windows. Oh yeah. Yeah. There's work to be done, man. So the work it, the work is never done, man. So I think the name of the game is consistency in this in this tech field, you know. So gotta stay on top of it. Anyway, but but I, whatever whatever news I find out on this, I'll let you know. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Nice talking to you people again. Chris, the Star Wars, the Dark Thing, or Dark Side. Go. Peace.